Welcome back guys. At the end of last one we managed to unlock the combustion engine, the little fella. So I think we should probably bring him in here and see what good we can use of him. I'm also wondering how. Uh, yeah, how, how should be pretty easy, right? Yeah, we'll just get a longer peg, get an engine. Boom, that's our combustion engine. Stick him on. And then we should be able to run a connection of this through. And that will enable us to put this on. And then we've just got to tweak this, get a longer peg. There we go. Have a look at the old stats. Much better max seed. A squidge on the acceleration. Let's whip these wheels off. See what happens if we get the wide carriages on. So if we put these on, is this going to help us unlock anything? And that's not going to fit in there. Interesting. All right, let's see. What is this going to let us do? Yes, this is what I was hoping for. So if we jump in here, hopefully we can get the off-road. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. All right. <laughs> so hopefully we should be able to jump in here and we should be able to get those big chunky dirt tires. I think they're going to be real helpful for us. Again, we're starting rolling backwards. Physics be physicking, man. We are relying a little bit on having some sort of acceleration that's kind of helping us get somewhere a little bit. Which is quite a windy course. We've got two laps of this. And we're on dirt and it's not too good for us. Ooh, sliding well. I'm behind the trees, behind the trees, awesome stuff, awesome. We make our own road, eh? There we go. Using the brakes a lot more today than we ever have done before, I think. the throttle try and keep us going big break whoa, 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 whoa. go to the side of this yes it through the trees. Ooh, mind the wheel. Oh, we're very clunky. Look at that though, our personal best with like 20 seconds. Almost up on our personal best. That was tough trying to get up there. We haven't won, but you know what? got ourselves in an okay position there we were off gold by quite a bit but we did get us a silver and we've got us some more dirt wheels nice straight the way we're gonna get these dirt wheels sorted let's have a look at this part i'm still unsure what to use this part for i'm still unsure what we're supposed to use this part for but i don't know i'm sure something will come true sooner or later when we had the ability to do stunts i was kind of thinking maybe we could use it to do stunts but so far, I don't see that this is uh, something that's available in this new, in the actual game thing. I think the way that things are set up are slightly different. So we'll see what happens. But this is where we are. And we would like some chunky wheels, please. And chunky wheels are going to cost us 70. So considering it doesn't feel that we are getting rewarded with as much money as before, it's also feeling that the money is going a little bit further. Like they must have tweaked the prices of a lot of stuff. It doesn't feel that we're getting too hard done by. I has upped my top speed just by changing the wheels. The acceleration's gone right down, but top speed has gone wild. Just for the wheels. Just to see what we might get. I'm just going to put this in. It's not going to do anything. I just want to just want to carry it with us. Let's see who we got to go where to see what we can unlock with this. Look at that. The long jump looks like we're going to unlock loads. So we've got to get to that. So let's get this combustion king dude out of the way. See if we can take him to the cleaners. He seems to have a lot of cogs in his vehicle. I hope we've got enough. 
Yeah, our acceleration is slow. But our top speed is there. It's going to be quite handy for us. Hopefully, if I don't screw myself up. He's quite far behind us, though. Hey, come on. Hold it together. Nice. say we were, we were doing well on our personal best and then that just one little wobble just kind of lost it all for us. Crawling it back though. Oh, why is this going to take us? Is this a finish? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Crossed? Yes, I did cross. I'm very lucky on that one. This road out here, what is this? Is that the finish? Not yet, that's gotta be it's like straight into no man's land. Hey, oh, sorry, folks. Don't mind me. That's a new personal best as well. Nice. Okay, we didn't unlock anything for it, but hoorah! So what do we want? Do we want to do this long jump that it looks like it's going to unlock so much stuff? Or do we want to do the hill? I think we do gear shifter. Gear shifter first. Because if we unlock the gear shifter, then we can like go crazy through the gears and that should help us with anything else. Plus, we know that we've got some top speed here. So if we can get up to top speed. Okay, I thought that was going to be slightly different to what it was. It was just literally driving uphill. Nice. We'll take a gold on that. Nice. And we've unlocked that gear shifter. Beautiful. So, we should now be able to ship some gears, which means this is all going to have to change a bit. How can we do this then? Right. Back in a sec. Okay, so here's what we've done. We've gone to the biggest and the smallest gear ratios, I think. I don't really know because I don't particularly get gears, but I know that small to big gives you a lot of acceleration and big to small gives you a lot of top speed. So that's basically what we've got. A small to big for the acceleration. And then what we're going to do is turn it up for the top speed. And it looks nice. It's okay. It gives us a 48 acceleration with 100 top speed. I mean, the power curve's a little bit crunk, but we'll see what happens. So we're going to go for a long jump on this because it should give us a lot of goodies. Ooh. I don't... Uh, yeah, we've got top acceleration that we can get, so... Okay, it was a bit rubbish. But it's livable. It got us silver. It wasn't the worst. And we have unlocked so much stuff now. Good old medium wheel. Juicy, juicy thing that we got there. Pistons. I'm not too sure what these do. Something that I never really used, but it is what it is. So just in general free drive, it definitely needs something to help its acceleration between when it first changes up. Because if we go from a standard start, it gets the second gear really nicely. And then that's a long second gear that we need to kind of tweak a little bit in there, see what we can do. I'm going to start a new car because I want to make something that's all electric as well. Uh, here it is. After some painstaking time, it is slightly not where I want it to be just yet, but it'll do for now. So we are small into big. Then we go big into medium. And then we're big into small, but we are running off two motors. Well, actually, there's three motors because there's a little one snuck in there, and it is just a medium to medium cog conversion. I did have a look at what would happen if we switch this around to like the big and small, and it goes crazy, but it also throws the build well out. At the minute, the build's manageable, it's not too big. I don't know how people manage to keep it nice and slim, but yeah, this is what I'm managing so far. It's looking okay. It's, it's kind of middle ground for everything. It's got pretty average to low maximum speed. It's got a nice acceleration. 
we'll see what it gets us. So if we look to the tech tree, it's this that we're aiming for. It's this motor. That's what I'd like to unlock, as well as a couple of these uh, longer parts and stuff. As a look would have it, quite a lot of stuff opens up for us. We'll try this up the hill thing again, because we could unlock the 205. We could unlock that. And the axis, so that'll be handy. I'm not entirely sure. Ooh, that's not good for us. <laughs> Gonna need sticking back together. They got us gold and that has unlocked us that engine part, which will be handy for when we do a combustion car. And also the big axis. That is really great. All right, I'm gonna get in the garage, rebuild this, see what happens next. All right, let's go for this, this rapid engine. And this is another ghost race. Pedal to the metal, see where we get to. Well, nothing's fallen off the car, so that's always a good sign. That's good. That's not good. I'm not worried just yet. It's early days. I'm a little bit interested. There's a ghost car that seems to go wider. That one. On, look, what's he doing? Going wider. What's that all about? Definitely catch them on the straightaways. Not too sure about the dirt though. out go flat out I don't think I'm gonna catch him before the finish it's gonna be really tight oh not if I do that though can we cut the corner we can but has it actually gained us anything Oh, he didn't make the turn, and it's that one. That's unfortunate. He's got a lot of engines. Only silver, wow. Need something that's a little bit more controllable. We could just swap out for one of those motors, I guess. Get this circuit race out of the way, see how we get on. too bad our initial starting launch is crazy these windy corners as long as we take the time. Be careful on the old bumps. Oh, that was a nice, nice, nice turn. We got it. Pushing up. Oh, 
No, all it takes is one mistake and it have a bad turn and away you go. That was a 26 second lead we was thrown away nearly. Or maybe not, that was only on bronze, wasn't it? But we did have a nice, comfortable lead. <laughs> Threw it all away at the end. Absolutely terrible. Ah, dear me. Right, if you want to come back and see me try and do better, please do so. I hope to see you again next time. Guys, take it easy. Bye for now. Bye, everybody.